What's up, YouTube? Today, I'm going to the 1v1 court with my multi-position defender. I see Beast is online on the court. I decided to pull up and take the court from him. And look how his dude is. Well, look at me first. Multi-position defender, elite one. No contact dunks yet. I'm telling you guys, once this build has contact dunks equipped, it turned him into a different animal. Videos on that coming soon. But right now, my offense is pretty limited with this build. I got to finesse my way to score, but my defense is amazing. And you will see Beast out here. He has a blue afro on. He has my exact outfit. My purple shoes on his playmaking for streaking up on the 1v1 court. I cannot allow it. So today we're going to see a showdown against a multi-position defender in a playmaking four. Now it's going to be really interesting. He by far has the offensive hand, upper hand on me. You see he goes into the paint, goes in for an easy layup. I know he likes to shoot so he's going to use that against me. When you play somebody and you have no idea how they play and then you play against someone and you know, you know, you know how they play, it is just a huge benefit you have because then you can play weird and get, uh, you know, get drops on them. Now you see here, he scored four points right off the bat. It's, you know, not where I wanted to be, to be honest. I wanted to come out here and just, uh, quick 21 0 him, but it's not going to turn out like that. He's able to get stuck right there, pump me into a foul, and he gets the ball back. He's feeling confident. He's, I mean, he thinks, you know, even if he misses, I'm not going to be able to score on him. Excuse a step back right there. He likes taking that three, but he's not taking it. He's being very smart. Gets the layup right there. Six to zero. This is it, man. I have to get something. I got to show out. I am a multi-position defender. I cannot allow somebody to score on me this easily. But you see, I'm getting the ball. He thinks I'm going to reverse because I do that quite a bit. It's, you know, my go-to move with this build until I get contact dunks. But I take a layup. I thought it was amazing. But this 2K this year, I mean, hey, you saw it right there. They made me miss. It was pretty open. But he's going to take a reverse and hit the side of the backboard. So 2K is going to 2K both of us. This time, same thing. He thinks I'm going to reverse. Hit him with a James Harden step back. My dude has no dribble, so I'm going to drop the ball. I got seven seconds. I got to make something happen. Hitting him with the same layup right there because, again, he's playing the reverse, but my dude is missing it. It's not a good look. At this point in the game, I decided it's not going to work. It doesn't matter if he thinks I'm reversing. I'm going to have to probably just reverse anyway. But I decided to give it one more chance. And if you guys don't know what I'm doing, all I'm doing is just going for the long layup. Basically, you let go of RT. You just press X, and uh, it just does a layup like that. Kind of where they like – it's like kind of like a floater layup. You guys have all seen people do it. But I'm missing, getting the roll right back. Big steal, big dunk, six points, three rebounds. It's been a pretty ugly game for both of us. He started off hot, but now he's not able to score. He's not able to stop me. Uh, I'm, you know, getting in the post right here. He's got rim protecting takeover, and his interior defense is high, so it's no, it's not gonna be a, it's not gonna be a walk in the park. You know, if he was a shorter guard, you know, even like a six-five pure playmaker instead of a six-nine playmaker, I'd be able to bully him more in the paint. But I'm definitely not going to be able to do that with somebody the same height as me. But I got my slashing takeover, pretending it's post takeover, hooking, missing. I got to get the board. 16 seconds. I mean, it's so easy to get your own rebound on the 1v1 court. Let me know in the comments, you know, if you played the 1v1 against somebody or you were the person and you were just able to get your own rebound four or five, six times or a post score was able to get his rebound four or five, six times. But a very close game, very ugly game. He's got his rim protecting takeover. I got my slashing takeover. Let's see if he can do anything to score though he's got some nice moves dribbling top of the key he's got to shoot he knows i'm there for it 31 percent contested six to eight it's time to make my move stopping popping i didn't mean to do that guys i'm not gonna lie my build doesn't have any shooting but i'm able to hit those middies pretty consistently off the little quick step right there but i miss it but he is completely boxed not able to score whatsoever gotta go for the reverse gotta go for what works Hit him with the layup. He thought I was going to. I, I'm, I'm not going to lie. This is like the only game where I don't reverse, you know, every play on him. Uh, yeah, man, I'm just trusting that layup, even though I missed it like three times earlier in the video. It's starting to work now. Now he's kind of thinking I'm going to do that layup. Now I can actually hit him with the efficient reverse that's not going to miss as much as that layup. And 6 to 12, my slashy takeover is almost out. I'm like I'm sad, guys. It's too bad I don't have slide, I don't have a contact nuts equipped where I go for those. His rim protecting takeover making me miss right there. Six to twelve. I'm missing a lot of shots, but on this build, I cannot lie. I love playing defense. You see, he goes for a park dunk. I'm able to block that, get an easy standing dunk myself. Six to fourteen. 
Rebounds are crazy. Block, that's my first block. Hoping I get a stash block in this video. We shall see. His rim protected takeover should be almost out. I get the nice slithery animation right there. You see, I'm 8 for 16, 50%, you know? Not a, not the best shooting percentage anyone's ever shot, but for a build that's, you know, completely red pie chart, only defense, not, not terrible as long as my defense is on point. But I missed the layup. He's getting one more chance. He is 3 for 9, 0 for 2. Sellout beast, as always. Let's see if he can cook me, if he can expose me on the big 500 court in the ante up. Cooking up right here. He wants that inside. He's not about taking any more shots. Gets his own board when I have hustle rebounder high. That's crazy. Gets his own board again. I mean, what is he going to do now? Nine seconds. You know he's out of stamina. What could you do in this situation? Does a step back. Going in. Hop step. Not the good animation, but he gets in front of me. 8 to 16. I've came too far to let him go on a run. I got to get the stop right here. Hits me with a step back right there. Of course, I'm thinking he's going to shoot it, but he goes in for the layup. Like I said, man, Beast knows what I'm, he knows what I'm expecting him to do. He likes to shoot, and instead, since he's got me on him, he's going straight inside. You know, a little cook right there, sidestep, hook contested. Finally, give me that board back. He's fouling me. He wants a steal. He did not mean to do that. He was not ready to give the ball back up. Let's see what we can do. You see, I got quick first step goal just to give me that burst of speed. I can't shoot, though. He knows I got to go to the paint. He just sitting in there. Little hop step. Little miss. Ugly offense. Got to rely on the defense to win. Can you win with just defense? I mean, you guys are seeing it right here. This man is struggling to score, and he is a decent 1v1 player. Hits me with the park dunk. He's got all the park dunks equipped because he likes the flashiness. Shout out to anyone in the comments that, you know, has the has the park dunks equipped. I do that as well. I like my flashes, even if you get blocked from time to time. He messes up right there, though. I had the shot. Waited too long. I'm flipping my hands. Little James Harden step back, fumbling the ball. Eight seconds. Got to get a little bit of stam. Got to get a little bit of a speed boost. Reverse layup. 18 to 12. I might be able to get takeover twice in one 1v1 game, and it is 18 to 10. Imagine getting a double-double. One more reverse. There is the takeover. How will we finish? this will he get the opportunity to get a 12 to 20 comeback you see i'm here holding him with the michael jordan at the top of the key getting around them little little step back i've done three times and fumbling it every time unfortunately i don't have enough ball handler to do that but it's in my nation to try hit him with the last reverse get him out of here uh yeah man let me know if you guys enjoyed this video uh, like i said man once i get contact down to the game the offense will be a lot smoother on this build this is tonic man i'll get you guys next time